930 on ESPN Plus on the app. Milrow going to run it again. Got a lane. Kicked in the turbo. Milrow. Goodbye. Touchdown, Bama. And outrun him. This man, 220 pounds and really fast. Great speed. Third down and six. They're trying to get lined up. Rodgers, they set up a screen. Picked off at the 25-yard line by Chris Braswell. Still on his feet. Miraculously scores. Bravo, Braswell. Defense. 14 to nothing for the Crimson Tide. Kyle Ferry going to attempt this field goal from 31 yards out. And he just gets it inside that upright. Seven for seven on the season. He's made 20 straight field goals. And there's number 21. Down in the red zone already this year for the Bulldogs. Keeps it. Right. The right time. Touchdown. <laughs> Run game. And right, it almost feels like a down and goal. Jason McClellan in the backfield beside Jalen Milrow. If you've got a run blitz, Mississippi State, now's the time. Touchdown, Alabama. McClellan results in Jace McClellan's third rushing touchdown of the season, the 13th of his career in the Crimson Tide, up by a couple of touchdowns. Milrow going to run it, put his foot in the ground, cut north, got to touchdown, and it came out. But he was in first. It's going to be ruled a touchdown. You don't need Noah Lyles, but you need somebody who can <laughs> run. 31 seconds to go. 11th play of the drive. He's going to throw it. Pittman, a race to the end zone, got there. Extra point is good. He has made 21 consecutive field goals. This one coming from 38. Made one earlier. Make it 22 straight from field 34. goals. 34. He's made 22 consecutive field goals dating back to last year. Make it 23. The last several years where they had first round pick after first round pick. Right. That, that receiving core is a work in progress. And Reichert in the meantime and in between time.